Ooh. Got a pretty good idea where he is though. Here he comes. Oh. Uh, I don't see him at the moment, but just be ready. So look, when he does turn up again. Yeah, 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 no, he's still there. You see this dark patch in front of us on the drop off? He's about two. See this dark patch here? Yeah. He's about two feet the other side. Okay. In that, just on there. So just drift it, if you can drift it over there, you'll go right over him. I would, I would stand basically here and just cast onto him. I'll get out of your way. So just, 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 you want to drift him just down the other side of that, that dark patch. Okay. You're going to have to really punch it down towards the water. That's it. That's good. It's going to go right over him there. Ooh. Yep, 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 yep. Nice, brother! Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Take your time. No rush. Shorten your leash. Wind down, wind down, wind down. Yes! <laughs> oh. Oh. That's why you need a deeper net. Deeper net. Oh, that's a beast. That's a tank. <laughs> well done, bro. Well done. Powers, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. This is Stephen. <laughs> Stephen just caught a really good fish. Not a bad way to kick off the video. I think, I think that's the fish I missed. Yep. So I just missed that fish on a dry fly by being an idiot and putting the fly out of his mouth. But he went back to feeding. And what do you have on, like a pole position? Pole position. Pole position under a dry, got the good drift. Boom. Um, mega days. fish, man. <laughs> mega fish, awesome. Okay, so um, yeah, I'm down catching up with Stephen for a couple of days and we decided we'd just to get up real early, do the big drive, do the big walk. And then uh, Stephen was nice enough to bring me in here and we've seen some good fish, real spooky. And that's the first one we've actually had a legitimate shot at and made it count, son. That's awesome. Wicked, what a place. Studying. All right. Got him. Yes. Oh. I got him. I might see this. No way. Or you can just throw it over. Uh, maybe we can either we can cross. Forgot to bring the net with me, so <laughs> Stephen's running round. Just 
try and I'll try and lead him up. Then if you get we kind of swap places, I'll try and bring him into this little. Oh. It's just drop. I don't want to go down there. Come on, come back up. He's coming, he's coming. I'll try and keep leading him up or what? I feel like we're going down there. All right, well. Oh! See you down there. <laughs> <laughs> Got no control on this fish at all. Here he comes. Stephen's come with me. All right, I might have a chance in here. Man, this fish is strong. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, buddy. Dude, where's he getting his energy from? Okay, if you can. Get behind him. Get behind him. Yes! Nice one, Stephen! Oh, wow. That's an incredible fish. Oh, that's a rocket. Drink. Okay, so that was epic. That was maybe the strongest fish I've had on the line for ages. Messed around up there. Actually, eventually ate the dry fly after all the messing around. Dragged us all the way down through this, under this tree, through this chute. Stephen ran down after me and I heard this big splash. And I looked down and he's just face down in the, in the river. But uh, we got it done. Great fish. Great day. What a place. We've actually got two fish here. One on the inside, which we've been trying to catch, which is tricky. And the third fly change, there's another one further up the run I can see. That one's feeding real well too, so I still feel like we're gonna get an eat from one of these fish. So we're just even just doing another fly change. Changing over to a peacock pointer. Let's see if this fish that seems to want to eat everything will eat this one. It's tricky. Getting later, sun's coming down, harder to see. Let's make it count. That's good. Come out, yes! Got him! Yeah! Take your time. We can move up the run if we want to. Don't worry about the other fish. 
Because we're going to try and land him in there. And if we've got to go down, we go down. It's cool. We'll tip out to the side. That's it. Just to get him out of that undercut bank. Come up this way. You still in contact? Good man. That's it. All you got to do is keep the line clear of that ship. No, no, down, down, down. That's it. Just so, you, so it's not... It's still on there. Yeah. Can you feel it? Looks like it. Yep, here we go. Tighten up. Go and tip down. It's okay, just keep it down. Can you still feel him? Yeah. And just keep that angle. It's cool, just chill, we're good. Hang on. He's done it again. Yep, keep it low, keep it low. You still feel him? Still got head shakes? He's getting you under, keep, come up, come up and across. Right, now give me some, wine, 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 wine. Walk up, go up to that nice water, bro. Take your time. If he goes over there, you just keep your rod tip real low. That's cool. And we go down, we can go down. Don't, don't give them too much shit. We'll follow if we need to. We're going to follow. We'll tip up. We'll tip up. Yes! You are a legend. <laughs> oh. oh, I hate this net. Well, I, don't, I, like, I hate the net bag. Okay. Woo! That's a great fish. Hold the net. Well done. I wouldn't have done it without you, buddy. That was a team one. Give him, get him in the water. That's it. Just so he can breathe. That's it. Cool fish, dude. It's a jack as well, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, you're clear. Oh. You got that. <laughs> okay, I'll go. Under there, and because it was a dry dropper, the bad thing about two flies. The what same happened to me the other day when my nymph got caught. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But so he went down, and then so two times when I put my arm under, I came down and I found the dry fly caught in some of that overhanging, so I get a root, tree yep. root, and I unhooked that. And so I put, and then I just then you were in contact. Yeah, yeah. Then he went back under and did it again, and I unhooked it, and then we got him out, and it was all good. Yeah, man, awesome. Woo! <laughs> Good stuff. You'll see this is dry flies going over him there. Felt like he may have seen that. Alright, so I'm changing my dry fly and my dropper because he came up like right under my dry and was either looking at my dry and or my nymph. And I can't see well enough to tell what it was, so I'm just gonna double my double my bets. Take ends in the hip pack and I'm just gonna change them both out. Um, 
just because we're just not seeing fish really anymore so I want to make the most of whatever shot we do get tag ends in the hip pack and then I'm going to change this nymph out which I kind of figured he would have eaten but what do I know Ooh, what are we going to have what are we going to have one of them I think this is the south side cat 3 and a tricky situation size 14 I can hear Stephen getting into some cookies behind me. Oh yeah, I still see him. He's still out there. Sure. I think you're Johnny Weissmuller. We shall see. Pretty tricky in this wind. Bob's already crushed. Let's get a good presentation. There he is. Nice. Ooh, yeah. Oh. Okay. Might be ended up over there again. Whoa, yep. Yep. Just trying to get downstream, change my angle. I feel like he's wrapped. Shoo, jeez, under the belly, I think. I can't actually turn him. That's it, we're clear. You feel head shakes again. Nice fish. Uh, you come on in. I'll try and keep his head up. Uh, yes! Woo! Tank. <laughs> what a river! Yeah. <laughs> look at him. That is exceptional. Wow! Look at that. Just a great, great fish. That is a whole lot of angry rainbow. come down one two corners to get that fish i didn't fall in this time <laughs> didn't you oh, I thought. <laughs> um and it just took a couple of fly changes like you were just saying yeah. like i ended up dropping down to like a size 18. tiny yeah because he just kept coming over looking and just not eating coming over looking and not eating so yeah i just dropped down and down and down and eventually he saw it and ate it and i didn't think it was that big uh that was a tank and i'm glad about that because we've 
what we've seen like two fish in an hour and a bit maybe so things are definitely kind of slowed down a bit but it's a beauty you're up, brother. let's you're go up. let's do it and this is the this is the nymph i changed to it's a little one uh, my buddy dave you guys will know dave uh, he tied that for me uh, actually for this trip so dave if you're watching bro did you proud mate did us proud Sticky's right by mine. Awesome, bro. Yeah. Ah, oh, stoked. Stoked. Very cool. Yo, okay, so uh, we're gonna pull the pin here because we need to get out and we need to get back for something. So we've actually run a bit later than we thought, but you know how it goes. <laughs> how long it's gonna take us? Cause, well, I haven't been here before and Stephen is renowned for not knowing stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but a super cool day, really, really cool place. Would like to come back for sure uh, another time. Four really good fish, saw plenty of other fish that we just didn't get a shot at or, you know, just smoked or missed or whatever so yeah awesome awesome little place Stephen well played man nice well fish. played thank you what a day what a day indeed give me a thumbs up drop me a comment in the comment section below and all that good stuff say see you later to Stephen have a great weekend everyone we'll see you on the next one peace